Thank you so much for clicking on WXYZ.com. I'm 7 First Alert meteorologist Chris Edwards with a Sunday that is going to be fairly tranquil around here, albeit on the cool side for this time of year. And that really is the main story today. We'll see. And then Monday and Tuesday will be surprisingly mild and pleasant as the cold air that is coming in later in the week has decided to take a little longer to get in here. I think that's good news. If you have anything outdoors, you need to do early in the week. First of all, we've got this frontal boundary. And during the day on Sunday, a little bit of energy from that will produce a few rain and snow showers north of us. Looks like we're just going to get some clouds. Here we are at noon with a fair amount of cloud cover around. And we'll keep a lot of clouds through the balance of the day. But the moisture should stay to the north. Now, not out of the question we could get a shower tonight. It would just be a rain shower as that system gets closer to us. But I've stopped this now at noon on Monday. And at that point, the storm system across the plains that's eventually going to bring the cold air in here is developing. It'll be hitting the Twin Cities hard, northern Wisconsin, parts of the UP. But we're going to be on the mild side of that frontal boundary. So we're going to see some sunshine on Monday and temperatures that get into the 50s. And it looks like that's going to last into Tuesday as well. Even milder air moves in here. While the Twin Cities continues to get hit very hard with snow, we should be in good shape. So if you're traveling that way, know that it's going to be a challenge. But closer to home, Chicago, for instance, they're also going to be on the mild side of the storm looking good. This is early morning on Tuesday, and it's not until later Tuesday that we could see a rain shower from that system. But it would all be rain during the day or even evening on Tuesday. If we get any snow, it would be in the pre-dawn of Wednesday and that's not likely. Today though, our Sunday 47 mostly cloudy, it does turn breezy, 10 to 20 mile an hour wind. Then tonight it's mostly cloudy, a spotty rain shower is possible, it's just a small chance mainly north and west of the city, low 39 and then 55 for our Monday, partly sunny skies and the warmest day is Tuesday out ahead of that system. There's a 40 percent chance of a shower mainly late in the day and then the cold air comes in Tuesday night down to freezing Wednesday morning so maybe a snow shower, but Wednesday 39, only mid-30s on Thursday, and that's the day most likely to see a snow shower around here. Could it accumulate? Maybe just a little bit. Those, these will be mainly lake effect and lake enhanced snow showers coming off the Lake Michigan shoreline. We'll keep an eye on it. We've got days to watch it, but the cold will come in, and it'll stay locked in at least through next weekend with December-like highs that are only going to be in the 30s later in the week. Need to get something done outdoors Monday and Tuesday. And for that matter, even today, look like pretty good days to do it. Whatever you have planned, hope you have a great one. I hope you keep coming back to WXYZ.com.